Hey guys, what's up? Um, it's been a while, but right now I am making some cupcakes for Tommy. Um, the other day I was, you know, I was on YouTube watching and I think, um, it was like Juicy Mac. She came out with a cupcake for her boyfriend Sawyer. It was, you know, just a funfetti cupcake with an Oreo on the bottom. And I thought that was a really cool idea with like a bunch of things that you could do. And I came up with my own little combination. Um, I actually already started. Um, I have the devil's food cake right here. Uh, I use the devil's food cake. You can use whatever chocolate cake you want, but I just figured this one would be the best. Um, I already put, like, I used an ice cream scoop and I only filled about halfway or so, and I filled each one on the bottom with it. And, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use Reese's. I only have 12, and these makes 24 cupcakes, so I actually took up um, some chunks of chocolate chips, which just happened to be melted, and I just took the chunks and just threw them in there. You can see, like, right there. And these are the ones I'm going to use for the Reese's. So I just went to um, Save-A-Lot, and they had a big pack. It was a six-pack of two, so 12. All right, I'm going to go finish these up, and I will be right back to show you what I've got so far. Alright, and we're back, and I have put the Reese's in, as you can see, it fits perfectly, and I already um, filled the rest, six of the cupcakes up with more of the batter, um, and if some of you are wondering, if you've already watched Juicy, Juicy Max's video, um, she didn't put any batter on the bottom, the reason that I did that is so that, since it's chocolate, if I didn't, it would just melt through and it'd be all ooey and gooey and you wouldn't even be able to take the cupcake out of the liner. So, I just want to do that just kind of as, to, as a base so it doesn't like go all over the place. Because she used Oreos and the Oreo is not going to melt and be all ooey gooey. And what I'm going to do now is just take about half a scoop like that so it fills up, um, leaving about a centimeter. Hey everyone, I'm back. Um, sorry about that. The I ran out of memory so the video is like completely cut off. Um, I finished up and they're actually in the oven right now. They've actually in, been in there for about nine minutes. Um, if you're wondering what I was doing, I had... I had enough batter for one more cupcake, so I put it in a liner, and I have this little, like, uh, sauce cup, and I put it in there, and I put it in the microwave for 30 seconds, and so I made myself a cupcake. I, I just wanted to make this quick video to show you guys that basically you can do anything with this idea of having a cupcake with a cookie or a candy, whatever. The reason I use Reese's is because my boyfriend Tommy loves Reese's, like, absolutely loves them. And so, you know, I use Reese's. You don't have to use them. You could use another idea I had was um, York's. The mint patties, you can use Kit Kats, you can use Butterfingers, you can use absolutely whatever. And I'm not really sure um, how it would turn out, but maybe like fruit, like strawberries or blueberries with like, you know, like vanilla or angel food cake. Like whatever you want would pretty much work. Um, so I'm going to go finish all this up, make my frosting, um, have it cool down, and I'm going to frost them. And I'm going to show you the end result of my little idea. Alright, see you guys soon.